Hello and welcome. This is Martha Hines and I'm with Farina Borrell. And we are inviting you to join us for a 12 month deep dive into conversations with the goddesses. So we are speaking to you. If you are one of the people who has been feeling called by these goddesses, Farina and I both have been feeling the goddesses and the feminine archetypes of existence really trying to make themselves known, remembered, and alive through each of us in our own unique ways. I personally have been feeling this for several years. I've been channeling a book called The Goddesses Speak, and um, and, and Verena will talk about herself in a second, but in this series, we are in a sense, answering that call that I know a lot of you also have been feeling. And so when we are diving deep into these goddesses over this coming year, our approach is that these goddesses are needing to become alive through each of us and through each of you. And so that's going to be the way we're holding the space, this really safe, intentional container of the year is to let these goddesses re-emerge as you as me, as Verena, um, and back into the world. Verena, what would you like to add? Yeah, beautiful, Martha. I love what you just said. And yeah, for me too, the goddesses started to speak to me some years ago. And uh, I, I would say channel to book about Diana too. And for me, it is so important um, not just to answer the call of the goddesses, but also to really tap into the energy and to discover um, the different goddess archetypes um, inside of ourselves. So with our goddess series, we really want to um, invite you not only to become aware of different goddess archetypes represented by um, planetary bodies, but also really um, feel them and embody them and awaken them as they are inside of you and inside of Martha and inside everybody and outside in the world too. So I think the, especially because we are really um, covering 12 different asteroid goddesses or planetary bodies, 12 different um, archetypes, goddess archetypes, it gives you the opportunity to really discover um, these many, many, many facets of feminine energy inside of yourself and to maybe um, be more open and have an open heart and um, be curious how you feel with these different energies. And I think that can help everybody um, to release maybe certain and paradigms or certain um yeah certain beliefs what feminine energy might be and we invite you to really with an open heart with a curious mind with um your whole body um dive into these feminine archetypes and discover the goddesses as they dance in you yeah Exactly. And I'll just add also that in my personal experience, and I think this is true for you too, Rena, another aspect of what we're holding space for in the series is the deep transformation that can occur mm -hmm. when we come back into relationship and awareness of these goddesses. So I can say in my own life, um, many of these goddesses have literally transformed my life over the past few years, but in particular, one would be Lilith for me, the, the asteroid Lilith happens to square my nodes. And when I've come into a deeper understanding of that, what that energy is in me, it's literally transforming my life. <laughs> Pluto has actually been sitting on my natal Lilith, which squares my nodes. So this major massive transformational experience for me personally, um, other ones that have really changed my life are the Eris Zena archetype, Vesta, the, the sovereign goddesses in general, um, 
and just so many of them, each of them has touched me in different ways. So that's another big part of what we're doing in this series is we're looking, we're feeling into these archetypes. We're also looking at the astrology of it and we're holding space for what transformation comes for you in this time, what uh, healing comes for you and, and what wisdom is also emerging through you yeah. as as we tap into and re-become each of these archetypes. Yeah, and I really want to add that for me, one very um, important archetype is Diana. Um, so we already ha have held a workshop about her, but um, just as an example, I, and not only Diana, but many different other asteroid goddesses, who are very um, important for me and who are on very significant points in my chart, um, I call upon them in my life. So it's they can become really a guide for you on your healing journey. And especially for me personally, Diana helped me heal so much. And I think that what is really important for both of us, Martha, and to say that at the end that for sure, Martha and I, we will um, help the whole series, but we don't want to um, present you um, fixed models who these goddesses are and what they are and what they are not. We go together with you on a journey through the heavens, through the earth, through you, through me, through all of us, and to explore together um, in a safe container with like-minded souls, discover what the goddesses um, want to, yeah, how the goddesses want to be lived in you and what the goddesses want to um um uh transmit to us so this conversation with the goddesses is really yeah it's the name is the program so to say and we will be in conversation with the goddesses and we will speak um we will let them speak through all of us yes yes and then a couple last thoughts number one uh this will also be uh, this won't be therapy, but it'll be a very trauma informed container. So I was a therapist for the majority of two decades and I have, you know, huge amount of trauma informed training and background and experience. So this is a trauma informed container, not therapy, but trauma informed. <laughs> and number two, this is open to and celebratory of people of yeah. all genders all sexual orientations. Um, Brina and I are both very dedicated and clear <laughs> that um, we are inclusive in our own selves and in, in the work that we do of, of all of our gender expressions and all of our sexual orientations. And so, yeah, you don't need to be, you don't need to identify as a cisgender woman <laughs> to be here. It's not, yeah, everyone's welcome. Um, yeah. And, and yeah, I think the rest probably you can just read on the description and uh, we start January 24th, Fourth, January, yeah. January 24th, Tuesday. Um, if you have any questions, please reach out to us at livingtheonelight at gmail.com. Mail at verinaborel.com. And I think you find the contact to me and to Martha in unteachable here right below the video so feel free to reach out we answer your questions and we would love 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 to have you and to goddess in 2023 with you and yeah have wonderful conversations and feel into this together beautiful see you soon <laughs>